Yo guys, before we get into the video today, if you could go and check out my second channel, which is content like this. Three, two, one. Oh my god, it's coming in! It's coming in! Then make sure to go and subscribe to it, leave a like and turn on post notifications. I have tons of new videos coming soon, but apart from that, let's get straight back into the video. Yo guys, what's going on and welcome back to our Rainbow Six Siege video and I admit lately the videos have been slacking with the spots and the glitches but there's been really nothing here but today this teleportation glitch is really really OP when it does come to theme park and it's going to help you out so much when it does come to ranked games and stuff like that. Just trust me. But for this glitch, you need to make sure you have got a shield. However, before we do get into the video, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, turn on notifications. And apart from that, we'll just get straight into the video today. And like I said, we're going to go on theme park and we're just going to get straight into it and grab a shield. So what you want to do as soon as you have spawned into theme park is come to like this room here. I can't remember what it's called. What does it say? The yellow corridor and then go to the arcade section, which is the upper arcade. And then come and grab your shield and place it on this line right here is literally what I'm doing. And you want to go and jump over to the stalls. So you should get a vault prompt any minute. So there you got your vault prompt to vault across onto the stalls, then go prone and head all the way to the back. Then as soon as you're at the back, get stand up into a crouch position and you should have a vault button here. Now what you want to do is vault and then stand up at the same time. And what should happen is if you do it correctly, so I recommend spamming B, is you'll teleport through the wall and go onto the roof. Now this is perfect for going to do any of the hatches in the bomb rooms. And I mean, if you do it at the start of preparation phase and get someone in this window ready to actually put it down, you'll be able to reinforce these hatches and it's so OP. Even if there's someone up there, it's even a more OP glitch because you can literally just go and get them and they won't even know. So here we go guys, I've got the vault button, start spamming A and B and up and hopefully I should actually teleport up there. Now this is only known to work on PS4, I'm trying it for the first time on Xbox, I've tried it on PS4 and it does work, but I'm hoping it does work on Xbox, so I think it should just be the same because they're both consoles. Oh, there you go guys, if you literally just saw, I got a little peak going up and that's because I was spamming B too much and obviously I wasn't getting the actual prompt going up because I was already crouching when I went in. So you can tell this does work on Xbox, so scrap what I say about PS4, it does work. And guys, I literally did it again. I found out the way to do it. Literally, just go over onto the stalls, if I can get back onto the stalls. On Xbox, this does work. So, come to the corner, go all the way to the back for sure. Then you want to get this point here of the vault button. Then, go crouch, and as soon as you can vault up, you want to actually go up. And I did it again, but still, that's a nice little spot area just to hide in, because no one's going to really see you up there. But guys, literally, you've seen how it does work. You eventually do get up there free... It's literally just about finding the right angle. As soon as you do get up, you'll go up top and it's very easy to do. Now, obviously, I did show it does work on Xbox. It does work on PS4, but it's sick and you just end up on the roof of this building. You can reinforce the hatches and stuff like that. But I don't want to focus too long on it. I'm going to make the video nice, short and simple. But apart from that, if you liked, leave a like, subscribe. Until next time, see ya.